that will feed us to summarize the whole week. My name is Nokip Kamboy and welcome to Business Today. And to start us off, the International Federation of Landscape Architects, IFLA, uh, while Congress, in collaboration with Architectural Society of Kenya, are holding the 8th IFLA African Symposium. The Congress is aimed at strengthening the landscape of architecture while focusing on climate change and biodiversity. The AK, in collaboration with Architects Sweden, have been granted the right to host the IFLA World Congress 2023, which will be held as a bilateral event in both Nairobi and Stockholm. Uh, as we speak today, I think one of the greatest challenges we face in terms of building collapse is that people are just on record, but they are not actually practicing. They are not supervising those projects that are collapsing. And so that's a major, major issue, is that on paper, it looks like there's a professional, but in, in reality, they are not uh, actually uh, carrying out uh, supervision of these projects. Uh, there's no building which is supposed to come up without being uh, an architect being involved. You cannot get a building plan approved by any county without an architect being involved. You cannot get a building registered with NCA without an architect being um, involved. The first thing would be, of course, to ensure that you have the designs approved and they would be approved right, uh, which must comply with the existing laws and the, the, the regulations and as per the code that we have. So the very first step in, in ensuring compliance and enforcement then would be first and foremost ensure that we have a compliance and as far as the design itself is concerned. Now into Banking Development Bank of Kenya has expanded its operations to the coastal region. Uh, the